Fourthly, you must have your own languaging system set up. And we talk about languaging, we talk about components like we have here. We talk about moving the free line, a curriculum continuity program, CCP. We talk about dimensionalized USP. What does that mean? That means we talk about, and that's, I'm using some of these terms here because they're new. Always be careful in using new terms. Never use terms, new terms, to initiate discussion in a marketplace. Always go where your clients are at and introduce new concepts for them. And that's what this strategic design model does here when we showcase people our business acceleration model. We also use concepts like BAOS. What does BAOS stand for? Stand for Business Assessment Optimization System, or our EPS, Expert Positioner Software. So when it comes to languaging, create your own. Ask. Use acronyms. Just attitude, skills, and knowledge. The only three things that can be communicated in the recommendation age. How many people are talking about terms that you're introducing to your marketplace? Always start where they're at in terms of language and bring them to where you want them to go. Number five, always build at an unconscious level your credibility. Now, there's three, there's many different ways that we do this on the, on here, but we do it in three three specific different ways. Put down as seen on TV, so people know that we've been featured on TV. We have our logo on here at the top. We have a testimonial here. In the case of Joel Com, one of our clients that we took to becoming a multi multi millionaire today using these principles. We also have copyright copyright logo with a date etc company name at the very bottom that all builds the kind of credibility that you want to be able to convey at a subconscious level that's why we call it unconscious not conscious credibility unconscious people are not even questioning your credibility next everything is color coded and we use specific shapes why to convey concepts at a metaphorical level, so when we use, and let me, use, let me state what I mean by that. In our ideation process, where we help clients think through their differentiation, we use a triangle. Why? Because we have a specific, uh, a specific number of questions, 16 of them, that we take them through from the baseline of a triangle to the apex of the triangle right down here. So we use a triangle because it conveys something at a subconscious level that we're taking them to where where they need to go and where we are designing to take their system to help them specifically solve problems in the marketplace. And finally, the seventh critical component in building your own design model is this. You must have the next steps built in, again, at a subconscious level. So when people go here, they see businessmentoringscorecard.com, which is part of what we teach using ethicalcontrol.com or uh, sellhighpriceprograms.com where we teach people the power of creating customized education the power of easily making sure that what it is that you do is communicated so that your target market understands what it is that you do those are the seven critical elements to putting together your own strategic model again why because I'm here to help you build confidence confidence and I know we all struggle with that because I certainly did. In terms of how do you communicate value that goes above and beyond what you've been schooled in terms of trading time for money. Putting value means that you make sure that you follow those three critical elements in terms of making massive impact immediately that I just covered. And then creating your own specific design model that covers these seven critical elements and incorporate in there. Why? So that you can get out speaking immediately. So you can start building a distribution list where people understand the importance of what you do into the urgency of now. In fact, what I'm going to share with you right now is how to put this entire system and automate it 24-7. So you don't have to spend 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, doing consultations with people into your highest end programs and services. What I'm going to share with you right now are another two critical elements to automating your consultations 
Write this down right now.